Heather McDonald and conservatives. You can't, you cannot be serious. See, conservatives and Heather McDonald, so illiterate, so illiterate, mentally defective. In this country, in the United States of America, black Americans have been experiencing a surge economically. Structurally, systematically, we can say for the last two or three years, black um, black Americans is, is, is for the last two or three years gaining the right advantages, gaining access to the right information and knowledge. And not only that, but actually making advancements in the conscious, having a proper consciousness now. And so, Heather McDonald and the conservatives say is that the promotion of diversity is making white men, white males, inferior. Conservatives and Heather McDonald need to realize it's not diversity promotion that makes white Americans and white males inferior. White people are not being punished by diversity. White people are facing the consequences. White Americans are facing the consequences of theft, thievery, pillaging. White Americans never had superiority. That was never the foundation of America. Europeans didn't find or found the United States of America. Now, that name, United States of America, yes. The Barbari, white people, white Americans, yes. That, that, Label is what's founded, but that land, that territory, that continent, white Americans are not at the foundation of that. So this inferiority that you say you you feeling within the last two three years of Black Americans advancing is causing fear, panic, fright, chaos, and now conservatives like. And Heather McDonald is in the, you're in mainstream media, spreading fallacies. You're spreading illiteracy. You're trying to invoke the mob, the mob rule, mob mentality amongst white Americans. You want another race war? 300 to 400 years of systematic manipulation, discrimination, prejudice, pillaging, exploitation, murder, rape. Plagiarism, suppression, it wasn't enough. That's not enough. So what Heather McDonald and conservatives are saying is that they fear. That the United States of America will be restored to its original state. And that's inevitable. Heather McDonald is delusional. The education system in America teaches delusion. So you live in an illusion. It's an illusional world. And the world 
white Americans are a minority. White people are a minority. So get comfortable. Conservatives have the McDonald's with being a minority. This is inevitable. This momentum that black Americans has been having has been for the last two or three years. White people have had it for 300 to 400 years, systematically. Colonization, invasion. You saying that that wasn't sufficient enough. So Heather McDonald, essentially, she wants to go back to Jim Crow. She want to go back to segregation. And I support that. I'm pro-segregation. And we can take over the territories that belong to us. And we could prosper and thrive with our own governance, our own separate laws, our own system. But that's what Heather McDonald is, is, is. That's what she proposing. She just don't want to say it, but you just said enough. Conservatives say enough. But what she don't realize is that sovereignty that America proclaims it has, it comes through diversity, promotion. It comes through black Americans. That's the mainstream symbolism and model of the United States of America, black Americans. Oh yeah, that's the origin of that continent. It's the education system that has conservatives mentally defected so severely. 